Welcome to Inside Sim Racing and a test drive of WRC5 for the PC, just came out recently. Uh, I would try it on the uh, PS4 or the Xbox One, but as far as I know, there's no force feedback yet, so I wanted to give it a try here. Running the T300RS with the 599 Evo Alcantara rim, set of uh, T3PA Pro pedals. Running the TH8A shifter in sequential mode. I was hoping to use analog mode, which basically you, you, you turn the shifter and you're running down the, uh, the neutral position and you can use it as an analog handbrake, but I'm just gonna use the uh, sequential shifter as a handbrake. Sitting in the uh, next level GT Ultimate cockpit, I'm running a stage in Poland just over six kilometers long. It's called Baranoa. Uh, and I'm running the uh, Ford Fiesta RS that's normally driven by ex-Formula One driver, Robert Kubica. Anyway, I'm gonna see how I can do, and wish me luck. Go, go. 30, right five, onto left four. Short, four, crest, flat, right, long, hold. 100, left three, very long. On to right three minus. 120, right two, cut, into left five. 30, left three, short, on to right three, into left four, on to left four, into flat right, on to left three plus, on to right five, on to flat left, into right two minus. On to right two, cut, into left five, on to left three, short, into right three, on to left two plus, cut, into left three, long, closed, on to right three, short, into left two plus, opens, on to right one plus, cut, four, left three, four, right four, into crest, four, flat right, long, closed, on to left two minus, 60, right three minus, four, right three, into left four, onto right four, onto right four plus, four, danger, junction, turn right, into flat left, Closed, left four, into right four, four, crest, onto right five, into left three minus, four, danger, junction, turn left. Four, right five, closed, onto flat left. Four, right three minus, four, flat left. Onto right two plus, Onto left two plus four crest onto left five onto right four four flat left short into right five onto left three short into right four four careful brake junction turn right onto flat left onto right five into left two plus Onto right two plus, into flat left. Onto right four minus, four. Left three plus, long. Four, right three minus, and finished. All right, so there you have it. Pretty good run. Force feedback felt good. Uh, better than I expected, actually. Better than what I remember in WRC4 and the previous versions from Milestone. Uh, not as good as Dirt Rally, as far as the force feedback goes, or the physics. I felt the physics on the gravel. I was 100% I was gravel on that stage in the rain, and I felt it was a little forgiving, a little too grippy, considered it was, considering it was all gravel. Um, but felt good, like pulling the handbrake, which on Dirt Rally, I think the handbrake's a little too touchy. On this, it seems to be about right, and you can adjust the pressure of the handbrake and the uh, setup options. Didn't do much setup-wise. 
I think I uh, moved the brake bias back a little bit, and I think I might have raised the suspension a little bit as well. So not much uh, on that front. Full force feedback, I think about half vibration. And in the Thrustmaster profile, I've got all the sliders at 100%. Uh, so 100% spring and damper. And, and I, I like that feel. It had a good center spring, good weight to it. Um, stage was fairly challenging, not too challenging. I uh, had a few, you know, uh, tight corners, no real hairpins, but some, uh, you know, some 90 degree bends that uh, had to hit the handbrake for a second. But it was fun. I, it, again, I think it's better than what I was expecting. I would have liked to have seen a little bit better graphics. Um, it's running in DX11. You have a choice now, DX11 or DX9, and I'm running DX11. Finished first. Have the, uh, I have it maxed out as far as challenge goes. I have it on expert. And... Uh, Ran a 254.554, so there's a little challenge for you. In, the, in a full WRC car, you can run WRC2 or junior WRC, so I chose the, the top class. And again, in the uh, Ford Fiesta RS. Uh, and it was fun. It was really cool. So I'm going to wrap things up, and uh, as soon as I sign off here, I'm going to run the replay, so you can, run, you can see the full screen replay of what I just ran. Again, it's only about three minutes, so... Hope you enjoy that. Hopefully you enjoyed my uh, first test drive of WRC5. More to come. And uh, going to wrap things up here. I'm Darren Ganji for Inside Sim Racing. See you guys next time.